What's good, Humble Squad? It's your boy, Humble Ziggy. I'm back here with another video. And today, we're back again with Chosen. And this is Dark Place, official lyric video. Now look, y'all. The last two weeks or so, when he was previewing this, hey, we've already heard. So from the last one he did, which was, hold on, let me go check, cuz. Like I said, 9 times out of 10, I gotta look over the videos that I did Cause sometimes, it be a lot and a lot of them that I've done So hold on, give me a second Hold on, just give me one second, give me one second Let me look, let me look, let me look I gotta make sure I don't get it wrong Cause I can't do my man, do my bro like that Cause whenever he puts, whenever he goes hard on this, on his stuff Hey Gotta give him his props, so hold on. This might take one, give me one second. Give me one second, hold on. Hopefully. Basically, when he did hopefully, he was talking about how he was making all the people making notice him and such. And I said on that song, that they was gonna notice him all right so on this one now this one right here he even took he texted me saying that this one is one of his most emotional ones because this one is talking he's gonna this one is explaining him from the heart he basically taking out all us he basically showing out all his emotions on this one so hey it's like this i promise him saying that when i get the time i will react to it and trust me I'ma keep my word on it cause nigga when it comes to him and his music and it's like this y'all see the hashtags there and such hashtag nf hashtag nf real music hashtag sad hey nine times out of ten his music and with the way how this is gonna sound probably is gonna relate it probably is gonna be on the level of nf and such so hey it's like this y'all y'all make sure y'all go subscribe to him man he working hard and make sure y'all subscribe to me too man like come on help us out man help him achieve his goals and help me achieve my goal of reaching a thousand k and help him achieve his goals of have making him succeed as more of an artist so like i said we about to check this lyric video out make sure you like comment and subscribe and without further ado let's get in the video Nice little wordplay there on his nice little wordplay on his on his name. I count my blessings every day that I was chosen. Mm. I count my blessings every day that I was chosen for this fate. One, one. I don't wanna go back to the feeling I was in. Drinking like the other night Team back together finally feeling hyped Mixing up the drinks about to add the ice Henny hypnotic got me feeling alright Throwing back shots like my name was Rebuttal Laughing with mm, Throwing back shot like my name was Rebuttal And hey it's like this Prior before this right He and Earn, If y'all had followed him and such He and Erno didn't like Get along together for a better part of this year But ever since this one and his song contrast that comes out they they cool together now so they back together and trust me i hope and chosen saying that they're gonna have a he has new music on the way hey can't wait to see it i hope he's on it too so cool to see that those two are back together so and i gotta react to his soon so i'm gonna be on the lookout make sure y'all be on the lookout for it and Watch out. We was just drinking like the other night. Team back together, finally feeling hyped. Mixing up the drinks, about to add the ice. Henny hypnotic, got me feeling alright. Throwing back shots like my name was Rebuttal. Laughing with the same friends, used to get us in trouble. Lost count of my drinks, where it was only a couple. So faded, caught it on cam like Ray Rice's knuckles. Next thing you know, I'm in the other room, sitting there straight sobbing. Crying about my daughter, hoping the real dad ain't fucking talking. Mm. Whoa. 
Oh. He was going to say that. He did say in that when it comes to this song, he was going to talk about how his daughters and such. So, hey. Damn. There straight sobbing. Crying about my crying about my daughter hoping her real dad ain't effing talking. Damn. Daughter hoping the real dad ain't fucking talking. Not blood related, but I raised her. Oh, now I get it. Yep. So basically, yeah, he adopted. Okay. Not bl not blood related, but I raised her since before she was even walking. Hey, that's the thing too, man. Shout out to Chosen Man for being a real one. For, even though he ain't the real dad, he was still there when he's when she when she did her first walks and such. And that's the thing. Even like if we want to be technical with it and such, when it comes to you raising your kid, whether it's a daughter or a son, if you want to be technical with it, if you're bl technically if the person ain't in your gene and such if it wasn't from your spouse yes i get it technically it wasn't yours but at the end of the day no matter what the kid is gonna be whether it was adopted or not it's your kid you gotta take care of them you gotta take care of her take care of basically take care of your kid no matter if they were adopted or not yeah you may not be the biological parents and all but at the end of the day, your your parents, you still got to take care of them. Whether they have to be your step parents or whatnot, you still got to take care. So shout out to Chosen for that. About my daughter, hoping the real dad ain't fucking talking. Not blood related, but I raised her since before she was even walking. Funny how this liquor always makes me dive deeper inside my conscious, A. Hey. And we all have been there before. Reminds me back when my extra split Found out about cheating, she was an innocent Just Damn. had my team, went on a liquor binge Drinking every single night, didn't give a shit Thinking back, I was driving, barely even sober Had a death wish, hoping I'd get pulled over Get with a hotter bitch, maybe that'll show up Maybe one day we'll be even closer In the darkest place, I was contemplating death Felt like she took it all, had nothing left Just wanted the pain to stop, wishing it would end Then I got a new message from an old friend She came over with the baby, knew she wasn't mine But the first time I held her, swear I felt alive All the hurt had stopped and I had survived through the darkest place you could ever find damn hold up just that the whole thing basically he was saying that at one point he wanted to end his own self after all that hell and such but as soon as when he got the call that about a baby and his daughter and such like he said it ain't even his but at the end of the day like I said as long as they the first thing that when it comes to a kid when the kid is just got up or even if they still a kid like a little baby and such the first thing they're gonna see is you in the world so with that in mind they are always gonna trust you your dad they're always just gonna trust you guys first cuz they only see you right now as their protector and savior and such so hey it's a good thing that ever since that now that he got his daughter, he ended that. Because a lot of people always end up doing that for him. that. Night didn't give a shit. Thinking back, I was driving, barely even sober. Had a death wish, hoping not get pulled over. Get with the hotter bitch, maybe that'll show up. Maybe one day we'll be even close. And that's another thing, too. He was just trying. That's one way how to fight back. Or even try to show up, try to s prove that you moved on and all, but 9 times out of 10, it won't help. So, see, basically saying get with a harder, get with a harder girl, maybe that'll show her, basically trying to get back at her for that.
know what Maybe one day we'll be even closer In the darkest place I was contemplating death Felt like she took it all, had nothing left Just wanted the pain to stop, wishing it would end Then I got a new message from an old friend She came over with the baby, knew she was a mom But the first time I held her, swear I felt alive All the hurt had stopped and I had survived Through the darkest place you could ever find Chosen, you did your thing on this one, bro. Chosen, you definitely did your thing on this one, man, without a shadow of a doubt. You definitely did your thing, man. And A, hey, can't wait to the next two weeks for your next song and all. But bro, all I gotta say is when it came to this one, this one is def. I took even though in the one that I said with hopefully they will recognize they're gonna notice you this one they gonna know that you one of the realest person realest artists ever whether you're underground or whatever at the end of the day if you're speaking your realest ish on your stuff that just makes you a, to me that makes you a real one for sure but hey y'all. Let me know what you think down in the comments below. It's been your boy Humble Ziggy signing out. Stay positive and keep the vibes up. Let go.